35 now and a concert venues in the city of Buffalo raising some concerns about a newly imposed fee that would have to be paid after every single event. And small independent venue owners are calling out the fee and City Hall, saying it would add tens of thousands of dollars to their expenses every year. Daybreak's Chelsea Swift is sorting it all out for us downtown in front of the, tall, the town ballroom this morning. Good morning, Chelsea. Good morning, Pete and Rob. That's right. I'm here on Main Street, and this is one of about 20 businesses that could be impacted by these concert venue fees. Several business owners tell us they're frustrated about the lack of communication here. More than a dozen business owners in Buffalo were recently informed there would be additional fees for events. The city initially sending letters in the mail stating that licensing is required for ticketed events. That includes theater, music, comedy, sports, and other amusements. Adding the fee would cost venue owners up to $350 per event, depending on the price of the ticket. After business owners spoke out, the city is backtracking. Instead, there will be an annual fee, but the cost is undetermined. Business owners are now looking for answers. You can't send a notice to a small business owner saying this is going to cost you $25,000 a year in, in the mail. This is a bigger discussion than that. There needs to be better communication. People from City Hall did reach out to some of the other bar owners basically stating, hey, we apologize. We kind of got ahead of ourselves backtracking. I think we're going to issue a one-time blanket policy for people that are interested in holding ticketed events. Uh, what that price is yet, we don't really know. Josh Mullen from Jackrabbit owns several businesses, which means he would have to pay a fee for each venue. He says he's concerned about the kind of impact this could have on the future of small local venues. Now, this wouldn't take effect until 2025, but for now, business owners are hoping to work more closely with the city to reach some kind of agreement here. We'll send it back to you in the studio, Pete and Rob. Yeah, right. Chelsea Swift reporting live for us. Thanks, Chelsea. 637 now.